Evening folks, a bit more of an informal setup than what we have going on right now, but we thought we've seen far more of you than you have of us, so we thought, give you a little behind the scenes tour of what goes down here in the house, it's going to be fun, it'll be a little bonus package for you, this is where we do our stuff, Queen's chair, there's the wardrobe. We don't really get much use out of this, sadly. I mean, Snow Queen stores our whisks in here, but that's, a, that's about it. And, well, I still kept the note from number 11. Little trophy. It's amazing how much more room you've got to move when you're not just standing there in front of the camera. Amazing how big the room is when it's just you in it. So, Bessie said there was something she wanted to show me today. So I thought, hey, why not let you guys in on a little piece of the action? Okay. Come on, This time of year, the light shines weak and grey through bare trees, if it shines at all. And some kind of harassed journalist, possibly a politician, or a policeman. His estranged son has left another message. A star pulls up on the wet gravel driveway. Too late. Always too late. A smoking chimney against a slate grey sky. A distant gull cries out across the water. Two cart kids have gone missing. He finds the corpse of an animal. It's best if you wait here. See him having a horrible time with a grey filter on the lens, a silent dinner on the bare wooden table. Miss Sir Joe is gone. A voice with a Finnish accent plays on the tape. They found her shoes on the edge of the lake. That not me. That's why you always must eat your vegetables. 